maturity level 2 continuous integration and deployment. For a rapid and reliable update of the pipeline in production, you need a robust automated CI-CD system. This automated continuous integration and delivery system lets your data scientists rapidly explore new ideas around feature engineering, model architecture, and hyperparameters. They can implement these ideas and automatically build, test, and deploy the new pipeline components to the target environment. The components that are involved include source control, test and build services, deployment services, model registry, feature store, machine learning metadata store, and machine learning pipeline orchestrator. The pipeline consists of the following stages. First, development and experimentation. You iteratively try out new machine learning algorithms and new modeling where the experiment steps are orchestrated. The output of this stage is the source code of the machine learning pipeline steps that are then pushed to source repository, for example, to GitHub. Step two is pipeline continuous integration. You build source code and run various tests. The output of this stage are pipeline components, for example, packages, executables, and artifacts to be deployed in a later stage. Stage 3, Pipeline Continuous Delivery. You deploy the artifacts produced by the CI stage to the target environment. The output of this stage is a deployed pipeline with the new implementation of the model. Stage 4 is Automated Triggering. The pipeline is automatically executed in production based on a schedule or in response to a trigger. The output of this stage is a trained model that is pushed to the model registry. Stage 5 is Model Continuous Delivery. You serve the trained model as a prediction service for the predictions. The output of this stage is a deployed model prediction service. Stage 6 is Monitoring. You collect statistics on the model performance based on live data. The output of this stage is a trigger to execute the pipeline or to execute a new experiment cycle.